Athens Roanoke police gave the all clear the annual drumstick dash went off without a hitch. It's a tradition for us at WFXR to get out on the course and cover the 5K live from downtown. Now we talked to runners and walkers and are bringing you all the highlights. Take a look. Runners, take Another year, another successful drumstick dash. There it is, and it looks like it's gonna be a winner there. Johnny Atienza and Emma Rogers were the first to cross the finish line in the Thanksgiving Day 5K. Atienza finished in just 16 minutes and 18 seconds, Rogers coming in behind at 17.35. The drumstick dash raises money for the rescue mission, getting Roanokers to move their feet so others can eat. But folks like the mayor's family come from even outside the Commonwealth to join the dash. Because we just love being outside. It's like a tradition with our family. Okay. We've been coming to Virginia every Thanksgiving since I was a little kid. So I think the first one we did was 2015, nice. 16. Yeah. So I'm not really sure on the dates, but I have the, all the old shirts. So. It also works off that Thanksgiving dinner. I'm very excited for mashed potatoes and mac and cheese. <laughs> Brian Lowndes, WFXR News. Happy Thanksgiving, Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Well, as of this morning, the drumstick dash has raised over $20,000 for the rescue mission of Roanoke. The virtual 5K runs until November 30th, so you still have time to donate. We have a link to where you can donate on our website, WFXRTV.com.